Hi, in this tutorial, I'm going to cover installation steps for Selenium IDE. This IDE helps you create quick work reproduction scripts. You can create scripts to aid in automation, edit, exploratory testing, and you can do simple record and playback type of inter interactions within the browser. So this is very short and simple tutorial for those who are interested in working with Selenium IDE. So let's first see how to download Selenium IDE. We will go to Selenium download page and you will find a bunch of instructions. and plugins As you can see the download page has plenty of extra plugins that you can use with your ID. So first we'll take a look at Selenium ID and we'll see how to install it. This is the basic look of our IDE. Now we are on Selenium ID page. Here we can download the latest version 2.4.0. You just have to click this link, which is .xpi file for the plugin, or you can say add on to Firefox. It will show you this message box where uh, you have to allow the installation. It will download into Firefox plugin directory. And it will show you a bunch of plugins that will be installed within the Firefox. Java formatters, C sharp, Python and Ruby formatters. But we are more focused on Selenium ID plugin right now, so let's just hit install now. Fire Dance will be installed after you restart Firefox, so we will restart it. Now you can see it's all also showing us another tab with firebug option. In order to work with selenium you need to have firebug. So it seems we have Firebug 1.12.5 which is latest version. Now we will see if the installation is successful or not. see in tools menu we have selenium ide here and we also have firebug in web developer menu so you can open firebug you will find the console i have detached this console from the bottom and 
I can move it anywhere I want. Okay, so I'm closing it for now. Now we'll check serial name ID. So we have it running. That means installation is successful. We also get this release notes page in the background when you first turn selenium okay if you follow these steps then you have selenium installed on your firefox if you are using windows or mac then instructions are pretty much the same because we are installing within the browser so there is no system specific settings or instructions. I hope you find this tutorial useful. Thank you.